Digital papillary adenocarcinomas are also sometimes called aggressive digital papillary adenocarcinomas and these are malignant sweat gland tumours that tend to affect the fingers, toes and adjacent palms and cells. They do occur more frequently on the hands than the feet. They tend to affect Caucasians and can occur in a wide age group but the average age is around 52. These lesions may recur locally and also around 15% metastasize, particularly if the bone is invaded by tumour. Grossly, the lesions are well circumscribed nodules and have a papillary architecture. Histologically, there are solid areas, cribriform areas, and cystic areas. Squamous metaplasia is often a feature. The tumour cells may be basaloid, cuboidal, columnar and myoepithelial. There is nuclear atypia with prominent nucleoli and variable mitotic activity. Another feature that may be seen is the presence of necrosis in the tumour. This is a very low power view of a digital papillary adenocarcinoma and you can see how well circumscribed it is forming a nodule in the dermis. On higher power, solid and slightly cystic areas become apparent. Here we can see a collection of tubular and ductal structures. Right at the top of the picture, there are a couple of ducts containing cribriform areas. And another feature is necrosis within these solid and cribriform areas in the dutchular structures. Finally, in this part of the tumour, the tubules are lined by low columnar cells.